One year ago, there was a series documenting the fundamentals on how to understand and use all heroes in Blue and Star Defense 6. At one point, the series was lost, leaving only small remains scattered throughout. However, this dormancy may finally come to an end after months of uncertainty. This series was, and is, Heroes 101. Quincy isn't really just a hero as much as he's basically THE hero. He's the first hero you get when you launch the game, and is used to introduce you to the very concept of heroes in Blue and Star Defense 6. Now, on top of that, he was more than likely the first hero that actually was made for the game, judging by the teasers that is. You may hear all that and just assume to yourself that Quincy is designed to be a tutorial character and is outshined by others. This assumption is only half right. Quincy really is meant to be your tutorial character, but honestly, the second half is pretty much wrong. In spite of the memes depicting otherwise, I would actually consider Quincy to be a premier DPS hero that happens to have the added bonus of being quite simple to use. As far as abilities and stats go, there isn't anything particularly unique here. Quincy's main ability, unlocked at level 3, is Quick Shot. Quickshot is simply an ability that increases attack speed by 300% for a brief 4 seconds, with an additional half a second being added to the ability's length every level. The ability also gets an upgrade at level 15, when the bonus granted becomes 400% and the cooldown is reduced from 60 seconds to 45 seconds. His other ability is Storm of Arrows. Storm of Arrows is an ability that launches a cluster of arrows into the sky and rains onto the balloons. This does 6 damage to balloons and 12 damage to mobs every time it hits their respective targets, and can potentially hit said target up to 15 times if they stay in range for long enough. This ability also receives an upgrade at level 20, with the damage increases by 10 for both damage types, and the chance to be hit while in the Reign of Arrows actually goes from 7% to 10%. Quincy's greatest strength is easily how well he can start a game. Not only is he affordable on round 1, but he can beat most of the early game himself. This is because, for one, his projectile tracks so he doesn't have to be at an exact angle to get things done, even though it's certainly recommended. Another point is that he gains camo protection quite early, and lead popping powers usually when if not before leads are actually on the screen. And his level 3 ability is a great tool for breaking up bigger clusters of balloons. From there, we also have his mid-late game, where he takes on a more supportive yet vital role. For example, we have the Expert Map Infernal, a common Expert Map for Quincy to be used on. He does great single target damage and can use some of errors to clean up, but he isn't our main DPS by any means. He's simply there to get the game started and to later play a more cleanup kind of role as the rounds go on. In the end, Quincy is your tutorial hero, but yet is also the most reliable. Also he's easily the sexiest hero. The memes will be memes, but the truth about Quincy has been laid out in front of you, and your job is to use it wisely. But with that said, I hope you enjoyed the video. This is a bit of a return to form, because of course this series used to exist until it did. And we thought a good place to rebuild it would be from the beginning, because it's the beginning. And if you'd like to give a little bit of feedback on where we're going with it, or if you'd like us to not just do it at all, I guess, tell us in the comments. But if you're really liking it, why not go like the video and perhaps subscribe to the channel? And that said, I shall bid you a farewell.